welcome to Mr. Otter Studio. How fun is it to look at all the flowers and blossoms blooming outside? We're going to take advantage of that beauty and we're going to make flower preservation art. Now what you see here are real flowers. I picked them, you know, some of them are weeds, some of them are blossoms from trees. I just picked a bunch and put them in this bowl. So we're going to turn that into art that will last and last and last. This is a flower that I preserved 20 years ago in 1994. And you can see those petals are still bright yellow. So let's get started. I'll show you how we do that. we're going to tape the flowers. So what you want to do is you just want to pick your most favorite flowers and just put them wherever you want in this picture. Now kind of press them down flat. So we're going to put tape over them and we want them to be as flat as possible. And the smaller the flowers the easier this will be. I should have taken the border off first, so I'm going to try to pull the border off here. So pull the border off before you put your flowers down. You can even, if you want, bring the flowers outside of the border. That might make it look kind of pretty, but it's up to you. To stick a few blades of grass in between these flowers. Okay, once you've done this, very carefully take your tape now you can do this with scotch tape too. It just takes a, a little bit more tape. We're just gonna use this packing tape and try not to get your fingerprints on it. And we're gonna stretch it and place it right down on those flowers. Nice and tight. Now press down. Okay. And cut that off. We'll worry about the ends in a minute. Okay, now take your fingers and press down really firmly to get that tape stuck really tight around every stem and leaf and flower because we want to get all the oxygen out. That's what we're doing when we're pressing down. that all along the entire surface. Okay, so we've got all the tape, but just take your fingers, or even your fingernail, tip of your finger, just really press all that tape down as tight as you can. Okay, now let's peel up the tape, make sure it stays stuck to your paper. We're peeling it off the counter right now. Now you can either just wrap that tape around the back or you can cut it off. It's up to you. We're just gonna wrap it. So now you've got this beautiful little garden. These colors will last forever and ever. Right, everyone have fun with this. This is a great idea for Mother's Day. You can turn this into a card. Um, show us what you did. Join us on Facebook and post your projects. We'd love to see them. Don't forget to subscribe. And thanks for watching. Happy spring. Bye.